Hi there, I'm Stefan and I will be lecturing the course on machine learning. The machine learning course is an intensive module at the end of Michaelmas term and it will be the last out of three intensive modules. Machine learning in general, I think, as many of you know, is a very exciting field. It's, it's, it's really everywhere in your day-to-day -day life, whether it's you surfing the web or whether you get a movie recommendation or a shopping recommendation or whether you read about self-driving cars. It's really everywhere in our day-to-day -day life. But it's not just the kind of interesting application which I think makes students tend to like this course, but it's also the kind of uh, role it has in the trajectory of your learning experience. Because in the previous intensive models, you start learning about Python and how to work with data in Python. Then in the second intensive model, you start learning about how to use that technique at scale. And now you take all this, you combine it with some statistics from the first foundational modules, and we use it all together to, to build some predictive model for real life examples. And, and, and that's, I think, which really makes it interesting also for you that you have this experience of putting everything together and coming up with something new. And just to tell you a little bit about the structure of the course, we will be having kind of theory sections in the morning and there will be kind of hands-on tutorials in the afternoon where you will be using real-life data and you will be implementing algorithms in Python. And that's roughly the structure. And I think it is very important that you have a kind of equal emphasis on both theory on the one hand and kind of practical implications on the other hand. Obviously, for the theory, we, we will need a little bit of math, but we will try to kind of keep it to a minimum and, and, and focus a lot on concepts as well as underlying principles and intuition so that you can get a really good understanding of how those algorithms work. And that I think is very important. I mean, to be, to be a data scientist, it's in a sense essential that, that you are able to implement those algorithms, but, but obviously you also want to have a really good understanding because only if you have a really good understanding, you will be able to to take your knowledge and, and transfer it to new applications and you might be able to actually understand an algorithm you have never seen before because, because you see some overarching concepts which you have uh, seen in a different context. Just to give you one example, so in the course we will be talking about some different classes of algorithms. There will be supervised learning on the one hand and there will be unsupervised learning on the other hand and within supervised learning, we will have classification, for example, and we will have regression. And you will see that uh, even if you have a very simple algorithm like logistic regression, which you might remember from your basic statistic course, that then when we later are going to learn about a deep neural network for, for image classification, which is something much more modern and apparently something much more complex, but you will actually see that at the end of the day, it's just another example of a classification algorithm in supervised learning. So we'll see a, a, a lot of the concepts from one being transferred to the other, and it would be much easier for you to understand it. So this is just one of the examples which we will see in more detail in the course, and there will be much more. So I'm, I think I'm, I'm, I'm really excited to be teaching this course, and I think it, it, it will be a, a very interesting journey for you into the kind of fascinating world of machine learning, and I, but I very much hope that you're equally excited.